Looking for the best LGA 1851 motherboard for your next build? Stick around, we're ranking the top 5 boards from good to absolute best, and you won't want to miss what's at the top. Starting off our list at number 5, we have the Gigabyte Z890 Gaming X Wi-Fi 7. This board is a solid option for anyone who wants great performance without diving into ultra-premium territory. It nails the basics and still throws in some modern features, which makes it a great starting point for anyone building in a high-performance PC on a budget. Now, what does this board actually bring to the table? It supports the newest Intel Core Ultra processors and gives you access to DDR5 memory up to 192 gigs. You've got four M.2 slots for lightning-fast storage, and even one of them is PCIe 5.0. The 2.5 gig LAN and Wi-Fi 7 combo will keep your connection blazing fast, and the board includes a USB 4 Type-C port with DisplayPort alternate mode, so that's a nice touch if you're into clean cable setups. But of course, there are a few trade-offs. There's only one PCIe 5.0 slot, and more importantly, no Thunderbolt support. That might not matter for everyone, but if you rely on high-speed external devices, you'll feel the limitation. Compared to other boards in this list, it's a bit stripped down in terms of future-proofing. That said, this is a great pick if you want solid performance and just enough high-end features to future-proof your build, without going all-in on a flagship. If you're trying to maximize value and still get support for the latest CPUs and storage, this is a great place to start. And by the way, if you're interested in any of the motherboards from this video, I've dropped the best prices I could find in the description below, so go check those out. Coming in at number 4 is the ASUS TUF Gaming Z890 Plus Wi-Fi. Now this is one tough board, literally. ASUS uses military-grade components here, and the whole thing is built to last. If durability and long-term reliability are high on your priority list, this board deserves a serious look. It brings a balanced spec sheet to the table. DDR5 support up to 256GB, a full set of M.2 slots, and built-in Wi-Fi 7. The Thunderbolt 4 port is a huge plus at this price point, it opens the door to high-speed data and display connectivity without needing add-ons. Compared to the Gigabyte model, this board feels like a definite upgrade in terms of connectivity and RAM capacity. However, you're still looking at just one PCI 5.0 slot, so there's a bit of a cap on future GPU upgrades. And while everything is laid out nicely, the connector placement could make cable management tricky, especially if you're working with a tighter case. If you're the kind of builder who values quality, durability, and solid all-around performance, this is an excellent option. It's not flashy, but it's dependable, and that counts for a lot. Also, if you're enjoying the video so far, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, it really helps out, and make sure you don't miss the next big comparison. Number 3 on the list is the MSI MPG Z890 Edge Ti Wi-Fi. This one's all about balance, premium features without fully stepping into the enthusiast tier. MSI went all in on connectivity and performance, and it shows. We're talking 5 M.2 slots, 256GB DDR5 support, and a slick all-white design that looks killer in a clean build. But what really stands out here is the networking. 5GB Ethernet plus Wi-Fi 7, which is a beast combo for gamers and content creators. You also get dual Thunderbolt 4 ports, which is a serious bonus if you're dealing with fast storage, external GPUs, or professional displays. Now, it's not perfect. The VRM cooling setup could be a little more robust for those planning to overclock aggressively and the price point might stretch your budget just a bit. Still, when you compare it to the Tough Board or the Gigabyte, you're getting a lot more future-proofing. If you want a motherboard that can do a bit of everything and still look good doing it, this one should be on your shortlist. It's ideal for mid to high-end builds that need flexibility and performance without going overboard. Taking the second spot is the MSI Meg Z890 Unify X. This is where things get serious. It's built from the ground up for extreme overclocking and maximum performance. If you're chasing records or squeezing every bit of power out of your system, this is the playground. This board is absolutely packed. 6 M.2 slots, dual PCI 5.0, advanced VRM cooling, and support for DDR5 speeds up to a staggering 9600 plus. It's built for serious users, and it's one of the few motherboards that truly caters to memory overclocking fanatics. The networking keeps up too, with 5GB Ethernet and Wi-Fi 7 on board. The main downside here is the two DIMM slots. For most people, 128GB is still more than enough, but it limits expandability compared to other boards with four slots. And yeah, it's pricey, but that's the cost of high-end gear built for a very specific kind of user. 
If you're the type who lives for benchmarks, custom loops, and dialing in every single setting in your BIOS, this board is speaking your language. It's not for casual builders, but if you know how to push your hardware, this one's a dream. And finally, taking the crown at number 1, it's the ASUS ROG Maximus Z890 Extreme. This is the kind of board you get when you want everything. No compromises, no corners cut, just pure, unfiltered power and luxury. Let's start with connectivity. Dual PCIe 5.0, dual Thunderbolt 5, Wi-Fi 7, and not just one, but two Ethernet ports, one of them at 10 gigs. The board even has a built-in LCD display for system stats or custom upgrades, which is just ridiculous in the best way. It supports blazing fast DDR5 memory, and it's loaded with next-gen ports everywhere you look. Of course, it's huge. It's an EATX board, so make sure your case can handle it. And yeah, it's expensive. Like, really expensive. But when you compare feature for feature with anything else on the list, it earns that top spot easily. This is for the elite builders out there. If you want the absolute best for gaming, streaming, content creation, or just flexing your rig on social media, this is the board that delivers. No compromises. That wraps up our roundup of the top LGE 1851 motherboards. Don't forget, you can find all the boards we covered today in the description below, with links to the best prices available. If you found this helpful, hit that like button, subscribe for more breakdowns, and I'll see you in the next one.